Okay, well, I'm just sitting here thinking about stuff, uh, about life in general. Um, okay, so, the stuff I'm thinking about right now is, we have a choice how we react to the world, and we may not be able to change the world, but we can change small things. Um, and we do have a choice how we react to the world um, and react to situations. It's our choice to be abused or not abused or um, reactive. They say that for every cause, there is an effect. Um, but you can choose, you know, we have a choice. In my opinion, and also about having a choice, my opinion is that, or my thoughts are, that... It doesn't matter whether we're a Democrat, a Republican, or an Independent. Um, it matters the choices we make and how we have an effect upon others, um, to some degree. Uh, it's important to realize that we're all human and we all make mistakes. Um, and it's also... Also, having tolerance for each other's differences does make a difference. And we do have the choice to make a difference, at least in small circumstances. Um, if not globally. Uh, we're just people. And... We should all treat each other with respect and kindness and caring. Not to be naive of our circumstances, but to appreciate those around us. Um, and even if people are disrespectful, we have a choice how we react to that. And to try to be a moderator and a leader rather than a follower and rather than being a reactive person, being a proactive person in moderating a situation and making the best out of that situation instead of creating more circumstances that have more effects upon others that are negative. And as a secondary thought about moderating situations, um, not every situation is moderatable. Um, if you're trying to, if you have someone that's oppressive, um, or say a culture or people that are oppressive towards you, um, it's not, you're not always able, or at least I haven't been always able to, uh, counteract oppressive behavior with, uh, moderation. Moderating doesn't always work. Um, I found, in, at least in oppressive situations, that competition, or being competitive, occasionally or sometimes works in those situations but it depends on the situation you're in um in order to have the best outcome the world is a cold place and it can be apathetic to an individual soul to combat the apathetic parts of our culture, one must concern themselves with the responsibilities of themselves and their neighbors, for we are all brothers and sisters in this world of ours. Therefore, having concern for others combats apathy. 
People do not combat apathy in general, are a part of the cause of intolerance, narrow-mindedness, bigotry, and prejudice. Fairness, impartiality, and justness can and often are neglected. Anger does not help, even if it's warranted, but being able to funnel it into something positive and finding coping skills makes a difference.